Hey everybody, it's Joanne from Artsy Light Tarot. Thanks for checking out this message. Doing a check-in for the sign of Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. I'm going to tap into the energies that surround you at this time. See what message Spirit has for you. If you're a cross-watcher, remember to flitch, a flitch, flip and switch the energies. Do not force any messages. What is the message for the Libra Collective? What does Libra need to know at this time? You are good enough in the reverse, so not believing it, not living in it. Spirit is acknowledging that you're being very hard on yourself at this time, full moon in Virgo. So I'm going to clarify this now with Tarot. So guardian angels, archangel, spirit guides, please clarify this message for Libra. So Six of Swords energy is Aquarius energy. It's moving towards calmer water. So you're in a place of transitioning at this time. You're not quite where you're meant to go and you're not where you were. So there is still some healing that is occurring for you at this time. You are rebuilding your self-worth and value with this. You are being divinely guided away from something that was turbulent, something that was chaotic. You are possibly protecting and taking children with you. Spirit is acknowledging that you are in a role of a protector at this time. Spirit is telling you to not forget yourself along this journey. Remember to put into your own cup. Um, you are being divinely guided by your ancestors and spirit guides. You are very protected. All of these swords are a means of protection away from turbulence. So remember to give to thyself, right? And then the magician in the reverse, there's a manifestation uh, an energy of blocked manifestation occurring at this time. Mentally, you are not in a place where you are being divinely heard because you are self-doubting yourself, possibly you are still dealing with some type of chaotic energy. I will clarify that. And then we've got the world at the bottom of the deck. So the cycle is closing out. So a cycle of you being blocked in regards to the gifts from the universe, the gifts that spirit has for you, you are moving away from that energy because you need to believe and trust that you are good enough and that you are being divinely guided towards something better than what you've been experiencing. So I'm going to clarify this now with Tarot. Give me more energy on the Six of Swords spirit. So we've got the moon, Pisces energy, releasing fear. There's an energy of being fearful, fearful of the unknown, fearful from the past because the past was very difficult for you. So spirit is acknowledging that you are moving away from that energy to let fear go. You are good enough is the message. All right. Possibly there are secrets that were keeping you stuck, secrets of other people, secrets of other energies but you are moving away from that and you are protecting those that you love and protecting yourself at this time. So there is an energy of truth with releasing fear and not needing to know everything, trusting your intuition and your guides at this time. Bottom of the deck, seven of pentacles, indicating that you are not uh, investing in releasing and you need to. So fear is definitely a factor at this time, Libra, that is keeping you stuck, but you are being divinely guided. You may feel stuck at this time, but just know that there is momentum and the universe is working with you. But you have to contribute as well with the Seven of Pentacles energy. That's Taurus energy. Please clarify the magician. Why is the magician here in the reverse? So the Knight of Wands in the reverse, Sagittarius energy. You were dealing with someone that was a player. Someone played a lot of games with you. All right, so this is someone very egotistical, someone that is very um, damaging, caused a lot of heartbreak in a situation, possibly affected children as well. So you have to release the fear of this person, but also of the way that this person made you feel about yourself. This person possibly gaslit you, made you doubt yourself. So you are healing that and trust that, that that is the direction that you are meant to go. So you need to clear this thought process that this person possibly inflicted on you. So you're able to manifest the outcome that you desire. Bottom of the deck energy, that's validating what I'm saying to you. Ace of Swords, communication. This is the communication that you need at this time, Libra. You need to believe in yourself. You are good enough. You need to let go of the of the gaslighting and the manipulation that this person, this player caused you because you are deserving of so much more. You may be receiving some communication outside of this message as well that indicates that. You may be um, feeling deep down inside that this is in fact truth 
right? So this is sword energy, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. So there's an energy of you figuring this out. That's an energy of truth. That's an energy of justice. That's Libra energy. That's your energy here. So trust that you will move away from this. This this place that you're in, this stuck energy that you are in at this time, Libra, is only going to be temporary. All right? So I am going to see what the outcome is going to be for you in regards to this situation. So Guardian Angels, Archangel Spirit Guides, please show me the outcome or advice for Libra Collective in regards to this energy spirit. Advice or outcome. Emotions are running high. So do not let emotions cloud you as well and do not let anyone play upon your emotions. I do feel that this person, this player from the past is someone that's very emotionally manipulative. So Spirit is telling you to uh, think before you react in regards to any communication with this past person, but anything because you are being divinely guided. So take a moment, be less reactive. Emotions are running high at this time. So that is the message, be calm. And trust that you are more than good enough. Do not let someone's manipulation cause you to doubt yourself, Libra. Please clarify this. Tower in the reverse indicates that this broke down for a purpose. This breakdown of this connection was necessary to bring things right, to put everything back on the path of the divine. Everything will be made right with the tower in the reverse. And this is why their emotions are running high at this time, because that is... That indicates there's been significant change within a connection that was necessary. Four of Pentacles, it's about letting go, letting go, trusting, trusting the divine, trusting God that you are being moved towards that which is meant for you, away from turbulence with that Six of Swords energy in the original. So Four of Pentacles, that is Capricorn. Anything else for the advice and outcome? Anything else? Thank you. Two of Swords, you're at a fork. A crossroads at this time Libra you have the power to make a decision make sure you're making it not only from emotions look at that make a decision that is going to let you manifest that which you are deserving of clear your mind right do not let so I feel don't let all these emotions and feelings and this gaslighting of this past person manipulate your decision the decision needs to be made trust that you are being divinely guided be present in the choices that you are making with this two of swords energy that's your energy right there, right? Let go of the past. It was meant to crumble. You have a choice now to manifest that which is meant for you. This is about being a powerful manifester. This is about being of a high vibration, Libra. And that is where you are meant to go. And that's what spirit is telling you. That is the outcome. And that is the advice to you. Make a decision to allow you to manifest clearly. Do not let emotions overtake the situation and trust yourself. Okay. If this is your story, let me know if it resonates. Thank you so much for checking out this video. Bye.